Oh, this is so cool. It's like the future of rescue operations here. Ah, oh, that is awesome looking. All right, let's uh, open doors. There we go. Oh, geez, that is cool looking. Uh, it would appear that one of our engines has locked up here. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Hello YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks, and yes, folks, we're back once again, and today we are going to be checking out some really awesome creations, and we're going to also be trying to uh, maybe make our own little scenarios here. Uh, this is something that I wanted to do here in Stormworks. A lot of people love our uh, sinking ship scenarios, so today I think we're going to do a plane crash and we're gonna do a attempted recovery of said craft. So this could be awesome or this could end in failure. I'm not really sure, but we are gonna check out some really awesome creations in the meantime. So all the creations are linked down in the description below. And if you're enjoying Stormworks on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. And if you have any suggestions for future scenarios, comment below. But anyways, let's do this. Okay, so here we are. We have the Ocean Monarch here. This is a uh, passenger plane that we're going to take out, and we're totally not going to crash this thing. Uh, this is a fantastic creation, and the uh, creator also has several other uh, very awesome looking aircraft. But I figured we'd start a little small here, so let's go ahead and climb up. Uh, do I need to activate this key button? Uh, let's get up into here. Oh, yes, this is a very nice passenger plane. Let's go ahead and push that. There we go, fold that up, make sure everything's ready to go here. Oh, there's a boarding ramp in the back. Uh, can I activate? Oh, that's cool. All right, let's go ahead and put that in here. All right, all passengers, are we ready to go? Let's go interior lights, floor lights, there we go. We're all lit up and good to go. Okay, let's go ahead and hop up in the uh, pilot seat here. All right, so there's our landing gear. Oh, there's a lot of buttons. They get the starboard engine, the port engine, nav lights, instrument lights. Let's go ahead and turn on all of those. Get that activated. Cabin lights are on. Activate our engines here. Looking good for a takeoff. Are the brakes activated or not? I don't believe they are, so let's go ahead and start to edge out here. All right, looking good so far. Oh, that camera is really close. There we go. All right, so, oh, this thing turns on a dime. Okay, we're good. We're good. I don't always have the best luck with aircraft in Stormworks. Like, I, I consider myself a pretty solid helicopter pilot, but when it comes to aircraft, sometimes I have issues with these, so. There we go, that's reverse. I don't want to reverse, I want to go forward. There's the runway. This is gonna be a messy takeoff, but a takeoff nonetheless. Wow, that thing takes off really quick. All right, let's get up in the air. Totally not going to run into any storms. Is this thing? Hey, I think it actually maintains altitude once you uh, go up. That is cool. All right, where's the uh, landing gear? Let's go ahead and retract that. All right, this is looking like a very glorious flight. This thing is so awesome looking. Oh, that is too cool. All right, so we have a bit of traveling to do here, so let's uh, let's get this going. I guess we need to inform all passengers that uh, we are running into a little bit of uh, turbulence at the moment. You can see the uh, the waves are pretty choppy, but for the most part, everything looks normal. Uh, engine RPMs, everything's up to full blast here. Hey, we're in the clouds right now. <laughs> it's kind of neat. You know, this thing is so stable, I'm pretty sure I could stand up and actually walk to the back right now. You know, it feels like we're actually uh, we're turning a bit. Hold on, let's stand up. Dude, that is cool. This actually would be a really cool multiplayer craft because you could set in the back here. All right, let's get back in here. Probably not very safe for the pilot to do. I guess it is. We got a pull. Oh, wait, no. Actually, we don't have a co-pilot. <laughs> All right, so this uh, storm has definitely gotten a little bit worse here. Uh, this is your captain speaking. We're going to have to turn this bad boy around and go back to the airstrip because, uh, yeah, we can't manage this storm right now. Uh, still everything's okay. We're just gonna make a turn here to the left and we're gonna head back to the runway uh, I think the heading is is it west or I think it's southwest uh, to get back uh, What's that? Oh, it's cloud. All right. We're still good though. Still everything's uh, a-okay All right, the plane is buffering around pretty bad right now. 
<laughs> this is a, I feel like I'm actually going, am I going sideways? It feels like the tail end's actually poking out. Uh, I think it somewhat is. Oh, you can see the lightning in the back. All right, we're still good though. Still good. Uh, searching for the island. It's out here somewhere. Oh boy. All right, still good. Wait. Wait, what was that? Uh, okay, we got a pretty weird noise there on the side. Oh, we're turning. Hold on. Uh, it would appear that one of our engines has locked up here. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're good. We're good. Oh, you know what? We're gonna kill. Let's kill the other engine. That way we could uh, see if we could glide down here. All right, other engine is killed right now. We're gliding down to the water. Uh, preparing for a crash landing. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, that was violent. Oh, that was really abrupt. Okay, on. Uh, are we... Is there water? Oh, there is water in the cabin. Oh, okay. I kind of thought that would actually fill up. Oh, no. Okay, hold on. Let's get out here. Oh, buddy. Oh, it's gotten dark. Okay, hold on. Let's see if we can climb out. Oh, wait. We got a flashlight, don't we? There we go. Oh, jeez. Okay. All right. We're underwater. Okay. The, oh, yeah. It's definitely filled with water. Oh, wait. Whoa. I think maybe we're, uh, we might somewhat be bobbing here. Hold on. Let's go for the, uh, the loading ramp. If we can click this button, we might actually make it out of this. Let's see. Come on, button. Eh. There we go. Click the button. Is it opening? No, no, no. Wait. Oh, is it stuck? What the heck? Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, this is terrible. All right. There we go. Boarding ramp. I gotta hold it in. Come on. Come on. Oh, uh, there it goes. All right. We can get out of here. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. All right. Oh, we need to get on top of the wing here. Oh, is this thing... Is it still sinking? Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Oh, this is terrible. Talk about helpless feelings. I thought the boat was helpless. Uh, oh, I think we just lost our plane. No, it's still somewhat, uh, somewhat staying afloat here. That's actually good. We could probably hold on to the back of this, but uh, pretty sure we're going to have to wait for rescue here. So we're going to leave this thing out here, and I've got just the rescue and recovery craft uh, for this plane. So let's go grab that. All right, folks, I present to you the Ash Cloud. This is a robotic sky crane, I believe. We're going to attempt to lift that airplane out of the water, but we need to get out there to rescue the uh, the folks aboard. So let's go ahead. The rain has let up just a bit. Still pretty bad outside. Let's go and open up the side door here. Uh, climb up in. All right. There we go. All right. Close that. Is this going to be some harnesses? Retract winch cable and extend the cable. All right. All right, so Sky Crane is good to go. Let's go ahead and oh, ooh, that lifts really quick. Uh, let's get out of the uh, let's get out of the hangar here. Oh, that is cool. Look how when it moves forward, it moves all the uh, propellers forward. Uh, there we go. Okay, we're clear. Whoa, this thing moves fast. Oh, oh. Okay, so I think we can make this thing maintain. There's cruise control here. And there's crane arm angles. All right, so it seems like it has stabilized itself. That's good. Okay, so we got our load controls. All right, so we need to figure out where the uh, the plane went down. It went down way up here, so we need to adjust our heading and make our way up to that area. Oh, this is so cool. It's like the future of rescue operations here. Ah, oh, that is awesome looking. All right, it seems like there's plenty of ways, uh, plenty of ways to hook onto things. I wonder if we could just straight up grab the plane once we get to it, like grab the body of it. I'm not really sure. Now, a lot of people, oh, I got a little too aggressive there on the throttle. Huh, let's turn on our cruise control here. There we go. There we go. That feels good. So a lot of people don't know that when you leave an area in Stormworks, your creations reset. So most likely that plane's going to be actually upright in the water. Uh, I believe we found our target. Huh, let's go into here. Let's turn off cruise control here. Okay. Let's let that stabilize. Oh, it's still upside down. Oh, wow. Okay, that's a thing. All right, let's go ahead and ease up to the craft. Uh, ooh, this wind's going to fight us here pretty bad. 
You know, I really figured that was going to reset, but it has not, so there we go. All right, so we've got several options here. Now, I don't believe that that craft has a, a magnetic point, so we're probably going to actually have to grab it with the crane and just lift it out of the water and uh, get it out of there. I would assume that we would uh, attend to the uh, survivors first, if there's any. <laughs> All right, so we're ready to go here with the loader controls. You know, that grip almost seems like it would be wide enough to reach around a part of the body or maybe one of the wings here. So how else can we do this? So we can make it go in and out. Uh, we can move that up and down. Can we actually move the... Okay, so yeah, we can lower this. All right, so we might be able to retrieve this craft, actually. This might work, folks. I really hope this thing can carry some, uh, some weight here because this is going to be pretty heavy. All right, let's, uh, let's get the craft a little bit lower here and get really close to it. Okay, we're starting to lower here. Oop, oh, oh, come on. Uh, gotta be pretty gradual. Let's get a little bit lower, and then we're gonna use the crane to perform the rest of this operation here. There we go. Alright, so I think we're close enough now. Let's go ahead, switch to the, uh, where is it? Loader controls. Alright, so there is a secure load button, too. Uh, let's see. It's going to be operation retrieval of this aircraft. Let's go ahead and uh, I need to open up the loaders here. Actually, let's move it back just a bit. This is like a big crane arm game. Those aren't out all the way, are they? Oh, there we go. All right. Oh, we're bumping into it a bit. Let's move it back. All right, let's move it down here. Got to be very, very precise with this. There we go. All right, I think we just hooked onto it. All right, let's go ahead and close the grip a bit. Now there's a secure load button here. Let's go ahead and hit that. What the heck did that do? That might have magnetized something, but I don't think we actually, ooh. That's ugly. I don't think we're actually gonna grab onto it this way. Uh, we'll see. Let's go ahead and tighten up the grip as much as possible here, all right. And let's go ahead and switch from loader controls. And let's see if we can lift this plane out of the water. Uh, oh, that is working! Oh, we grabbed that at a very, very bad angle. The uh, the tail section's actually hitting us. Oh boy, folks, this is a uh, this isn't good. It lifts it, but it just it can't grab it because the tail section came and actually hit us. Okay, uh, question number two is, is there a winch or is there a connecting section that we can get on? All right, still trying to grab onto it here. Uh, yeah, keep hearing a click almost like we have it. Uh, is this working? Wait a minute. Did it actually grab onto something there? Hold on, let's, uh, we've got it partially lifted up here. Is it slipping? Okay, let's go ahead and switch out of loader controls. All right, let's try to gradually, uh, let's try to lift this up here. Oh, oh, no way. No way that's actually working. Are you kidding me? We actually just got this out of the water? Oh, it makes it really unstable, but we retrieved the plane. This is the craziest thing that I've seen in Stormworks. Yeah, it's, uh, it's magnetized. Uh-oh, oh, 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 jeez. Oh, jeez. All right, you know what? You know what? I felt like we somewhat were successful because I didn't actually think this thing was going to be able to lift that out of the water. But you know what? We're going to let that aircraft just go to the bottom of the sea. We'll collect the survivors and we'll head back to base and have a nice coffee or something because I don't have much patience and I don't think we're going to actually clip this on and be able to fly all the way back to the, uh, the main area. But this is definitely a very awesome creation. Uh, I've never uh, quite seen something like this in Stormworks. So, anyways, let's go ahead and move on to the next thing. All right, folks, we have something new here. Apparently, this game updated. I didn't actually see the update come out. There is a new mission here called Rig Emergencies. All right, so the Brilliant Fuels oil platform have been battling further equipment failures, and reportedly they are managing a small fire before communications were lost. Travel to the Brilliant Fuels oil platform and evaluate the situation. Folks, this is fire. This is something I mentioned last uh, Sinking Ship episode. 
What the heck? Okay, we need to find a helicopter big enough to transport crew. All right, so we have an Airbus helicopter here that we're going to take out uh, to the oil rig. Now, keep in mind, with the fires, I'm pretty sure they've added some new parts as far as being able to fight fires. I don't have anything right now with that equipped. So we're just going to kind of evaluate the situation here. If we can get people off the platform, that would be good. There we go. Oh, this is a sweet looking helicopter, by the way. Uh, but yeah, I really want to see what this looks like. Now, also, supposedly they've added some sort of mission editor. So, no telling what type of trouble we're going to get into soon. And I think it's going to have workshop support. So, maybe we'll see some burning ships and stuff like that. I'm not really sure how the fire works. Or if it's just limited to the oil platform. But anyways, uh, we are on our way. Let's, uh, oh, 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 go up, go up, go up. There we go. All right, let's get out to this uh, platform here. All right, visibility is not the greatest right now. It is a night. Uh, we're coming up to the oil platform. It looks not bad at the moment. Oh, wait. No. Whoa. Okay, yeah, it's definitely on fire. All right, so let's locate the uh, helipad. It's going to be on the left side. I don't wonder if they have fire, uh, like firefighting capabilities uh, aboard to that. I'm not really sure. Okay, so I know we need to get the rig workers. All right, so oh buddy, oh that looks bad. All right, yeah, this is a uh, this looks like a new oil rig. All right, let's go ahead and start to lower here. Oh boy. All right, so this is gonna be a rig uh, rescue here. Wait, this one's got a uh, lifeboats on the side of it. Dude, that's so cool. All right, let's go ahead, lower down, lower down. Oh yeah, they've had a blowout here. All right, we have touchdown. All right, we got a fire raging ahead of us here. Let's go ahead, make sure we got landing gears. All right, we're good to go. Let's go ahead and evac out here. All right, let's uh, open doors. There we go. Oh, geez, that is cool looking. All right, so we got rig workers below. Do we have anything? What are you doing? Are you ignoring the fire? Uh, can you deploy these boats? Okay, hold on. We got to figure out where we are here. All right, so it looks like crew quarters. They don't have any way to fight these fires, do they? Oh, geez. Oh, that is cool. All right, let's uh, let's see if we can get down to the bottom deck. Oh, buddy. Oh, that's a fire. Okay, is there anybody? Where's everybody hiding at? Oh, in here? Let's go ahead and open this up. Hello, are we ready to uh, probably escape this oil rig? Come on. Oh, this platform is completely on fire right now. I don't know if it spreads or not. Uh, it's still, <laughs> it just looks terrible. All right. I don't know what this person over here, they don't seem to be too thrilled and they don't want to come aboard. Uh, but we'll leave that person to sit there and stare at the ocean. Okay, we need people to get in, so we're going to pick you up, toss you in, pick you up, toss you in. Everybody hold on, i got to go rescue the other ones. Oh, they're on the platform. They're like up here on the catwalks. Uh, oh boy. Uh, is this the only way up? No, how do we... Oh, wow. Okay. All right, just run through. Oh, boy. Yeah, I don't think we could die at the moment. That's probably not the way we want to go up, though. Is there another way up this platform? Oh, jeez. Yeah, I don't believe we brought the right equipment here. All right, you need to... Here, I'm going to pick you up. Can I chunk you over this? No. All right, you're going to have to follow uh, me. Uh, yeah, you're going to have to follow me. We're going to have to go back through this. Okay, can we... Uh, can you get up this? All right, I hope you're ready to jump. Here we go. Come on, buddy. Oh, jeez, where'd he go? Did he jump? Oh, he did. Okay, we're good. Hold on, let's get out to the helipad here. Oh, boy. All right, get aboard. All right, let's climb up here. We need to get out of here right now. This is pretty bad. Here we go. Gyro's activated. All right, lift. Oh, buddy. Oh, that is so cool looking. All right, let's pull off. All right, let's get to the hospital here. I know just real quick, I did read, uh, there is firefighting equipment available now. Uh, but I guess we don't have to use it for that one. But I'm going to be curious, like, what do you guys think you're going to see here in the future? Are we going to have burning boats? Uh, be able to go put out these oil rigs that are on fire? Man, we could have fire boats. Uh, is there such thing as, like, a fire helicopter that actually sprays water? 
Or heck, we could even have one of those big cargo planes that drops all the water uh, on top of stuff. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Yeah, I'm going to look forward to actually uh, digging deeper into this. But anyways, we need to get over to the hospital and uh, deliver these rig workers. So I just read on the mission that we have the option to extinguish that fire. Uh, also while saving the rig workers. So ideally, you'd have a boat with a deployable helicopter. Maybe get the rig workers off and then extinguish the fire. But like I said, we'll probably have to wait till next episode uh, before we actually fight the fires. Uh, because of the fact of, I don't even know how the equipment works. I'm pretty sure it's going to need to be hooked up to a pumping system. Like, I, I don't believe it's, hey, you just stick a water gun on the front of something and it, and it works. So we'll have to see. All right, here we come up to the hospital. I'm so uh, pumped just to know that this update's already out. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go to work probably after this episode, and we'll uh, see kind of what we can do here. I'm really also curious how the uh, the mission editor works, because I've already thought of some crazy stuff that we can do. Like, I wonder if we could somehow incorporate the sinking ships into the mission editor. Uh, that could be a thing. So I'll look into that. Let's go ahead and drop off our rig workers here. All right, well, we didn't save your platform, but we saved your lives. So I think that... Oh, did I not deploy the landing gear? Oh, it was deployed. Okay. Yeah. So uh, you guys better be thankful. Uh, you know what? Actually, it finally looks like everybody's in the appropriate attire. These actually look like rig workers. Sometimes when you see uh, people on the rigs or people in certain situations, they don't look like like they should. They look like sometimes you'll see like a vacationer up there or something. All right, people, move out the way. On, uh, Follow me. All right, everybody. Let's uh, go into the hospital, get you guys checked up. Let's go and open that. All right, come in here, please. There we go. All right, so this is where you would drop everybody off. Of course, it's not giving me a mission complete because of the fact of the uh, rig still on fire. Uh, but what, like I said, we'll have to figure that out for next episode. But anyways, folks, I think it's going to wrap it up for this episode. Uh, I've got a bit of work to do to go check. What are they doing? They're just bouncing off the walls like flies. Hey, guy. You guys, uh, you're keeping me out. You guys stay in there. <laughs> but anyways, like I said, that's going to wrap it up for this episode of Stormworks. Uh, we will dive into the update fully next episode. Should be on this weekend. I uh, might do a little bit more sinking ship survival. I have more of it planned, but the update's going to come first as far as we're going to go out and discover what we can all do in some of the new missions. So we will be doing that next episode. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and we will see you guys next time on Stormworks.